degrees and sunny. Just the way I always wanted. Tall but I got the upside. 
I will probably get more, I'm not gonna lie. Something that I do want to note is that this ones come a little bit bigger. They're the same size. They are 35 and the Chanel ones are 35 too, but you can see them like a bit side by side. It's just slightly bigger, so it was a little bit big on me. But they gave me at the store this inserts that actually made them fit quite perfect. With this, they're even more comfortable and they fit me perfect, but if you were planning to get the Dior ones and you're a fan of the Chanel ballerinas, just note that these ones come a little bit bigger and these ones are a bit more true to size. And I was showing you Polo's tie. He was very specific with the blue color that he was looking for the tie and we couldn't find it here in Barcelona, so when I went to Paris, I literally tried to check almost every single one of the Hermes boutiques for the perfect blue tie and I think I found it. He loves it so much. This is going to be like the starter piece to design his suit. I'll let him explain basically what he wants to do with it But we're not gonna go with navy blue or black or anything too dark Actually, his suit is going to be lighter In my opinion, this is one of the prettiest ties that I've ever seen I love the color I'm going to try to show the true color because sometimes it's tricky to get blue He already tried it, he loves it So we're basically gonna take it and design from scratch the suit So that's going to be very interesting And the last thing that I want to show you is the most special of them all This was a gift from Puello's mom, so my future mother-in-law Many of you have seen her on my vlogs when they come to visit or when we visit them And she got this made for me for the wedding. It's my something blue I absolutely love them. So I really want to show them This is not the original box that they came in, but I cannot find it. So I just put them here They are absolutely stunning and they literally fit the theme of the wedding perfectly I love them so so much. I kind of want to start wearing them from now I think I'm gonna wear them a little bit. She literally designed this with Polo and Geraldine So they're just beautiful the size the color they're just perfect. I love them so much. For now, I'm gonna save them away, but I think that I'm gonna definitely start wearing them soon. So I'm going to change. I don't want it to be too late. I definitely need to go to Remova quite early when they open and see what they can do. I'll show you what it's doing, but it's just kind of squeaky, kind of annoying. We just love to go out, sit on a cafe and get some sun and wait a little bit for Polo's appointment for his suit. Maybe we can cook something tonight. Let's see, but yeah, I'm gonna change. Okay, so I'm in the closet and I'm trying to decide if today I'm gonna go with a sweater or a trench coat. The weather is so nice that I think that just with the t-shirt that I have underneath and the trench coat, it's going to be enough. And I'll use the sweater here at the house because the apartment is quite chilly. I'm gonna go with dark beige and white. And for contrast, I'm gonna go with a darker bag. I think today is a Kelly day and it does fit my vlogging camera inside no problem. So this is going to be it. It's basically a trench coat with white pants. The belt is from Polen, white t-shirt. And this one is quite comfortable for this type of days because it's short, so it doesn't really get in the way. And I think it goes very, very well with the bag. But but since we're not leaving the house yet, I'm gonna go back to the sweater. So these are the wedding invites. These were actually sent months ago, but I wanted to show them to you because I love them so, so much that I just really wanted to recommend the company that made them for us. And you can see the details. They are just so, so pretty. This is in gold foiling and you can see that it has like underneath in white. And this is how they look on the inside. Yes. I know, very dear. They also came with a wax seal that I'm not going to break because this is one of the few spares that we have. I still don't know what we're gonna do with the extras, but something will come up. I just want to have a few to remember. And I can show you the top of the invite. They added the chateau right here, so they're just beautiful. I'm going to leave their Instagram on the description box and right here in case anyone was looking for any type of invitations or menus. They're also gonna do the menus for our wedding. They are so, so beautiful. Literally everyone that we have sent them to have told us how much they love them and that they don't really want to break the wax seal. So yes, we have that update. And the other one that I have is that my wedding dress is ready. I didn't get my wedding dress here in Barcelona. So we're actually going to have to take a quick trip to Madrid. This will be probably a one day trip or something like that. We will take the train, but I am so excited to go and see it again. I don't know, but I feel like I blacked out a little bit how it actually looked on me because I didn't take that many pictures. I just remember knowing that it was it. And of course I know how the dress looks like, but not a hundred percent so i really want to go and try it on again and make the alterations we're definitely gonna change a bit here and there just to make it perfect for that day so that's going to be next vlog we're also going to go to my favorite restaurants because something that i miss a lot about madrid are literally the restaurants i have a few that yes or yes we're gonna have to make a reservation because i really want to go so that's basically going to be the plan for next week as for right now i'm just waiting for polo to finish some things and then just go probably to el gotico because we haven't really gone in a while since winter started we stopped going
going to a few places here in the city so i feel like going out sitting outside having a coffee or something like that checking a few stores and then we're gonna come back and cook something for dinner so for my suit i was at first looking for like a typical navy blue suit like a three-piece suit thinking about it i don't want to go exactly as everyone is going like every guest is going with a navy suit also since we're getting married like end of spring in a chateau in france so maybe blue was a little too serious or too formal so now we're looking for something more light like a beige and maybe also change like the fabric we were thinking of going with linen so it could be a really nice combination like the linen i can put some inspiration pictures on this yeah so actually right now i'm um, Pinterest, Pinterest looking for the combination because I want a three piece so the jacket the vest and the pants also this is a remova that we want to take in so they can check it out I'm going to move it around so you can hear it out and also we have issues with the handle because it always goes down like it's supposed to be locked here, but if I push down, it's going to go down. So it just doesn't stay up. So I'm gonna grab the luggage and sneak it outside because if Masha sees it, she's gonna think that we're gonna go on vacation. And she freaks out a little bit if we leave her at home after she sees luggage like going out the door. So Polo is right now with Masha locked in the office and I'm just gonna try to sneak it out. So she doesn't see it and just thinks that we're gonna go out to grab lunch and then come back. So I'm gonna grab my trench coat and my bag and let's go out. So a little bit of a recap, in Remova they did take it in and yes, they are definitely going to replace the entire handle and they're gonna see what they can do for the wheels because I think we're gonna have to end up changing them because they do squeak quite loud and it's annoying but it's going to be really fast so we don't really have to worry about Madrid, we're gonna have it in time. And as for Cartier, I left my watch to engrave it and we're making time to go pick it up. We just got a few things to make pizza so we're gonna have pizza tonight and this is one of our favorite spots to grab a drink, it's called Plaza del Rey and this is actually a castle. They close this restaurant for a while but they reopened it and now we can come have drinks again which I love during the night they play music and there's like dances and everything is like full of lights I just really love it here so we're gonna make some pizzas I think just two pizzas so we're gonna make one with goat cheese and honey and the other one with ham just like simple pizzas i made the sauce homemade sauce homemade sauce it's a little bit spicy and we have the dough
Basically, pizza chèvre miel is something that we would eat like once a week when we were living in Toulouse, France. And it's basically goat cheese with honey. I know that it doesn't sound tasty or good if you haven't tried it. I didn't think that I was going to like it at first, but now it's my favorite type of pizza. So when we do it at home, I love to have that one. Paulo also likes it, just not as much as me. I like it. And I don't know why, but I can never do round pizzas. So they are always square. Well, rectangular pizzas. This is kind of a circle, I think. So, a little bit of sauce. A little more. Now, some of this cheese. So we have the pizza in the oven, we're gonna let it cook for a bit, like 20 minutes and when this one is finished, we're gonna put the other one in the oven and just enjoy the pizzas just like watching TV. So I didn't realize how tiring it was gonna be to make a custom suit, like you have to make all of your measurements, you have to pick the fabric, so I guess it was the same for Rue, like with her dress, but I'm really excited about my suit, I think it's gonna be like kind of different and I'm also excited that I can use it on other occasions and not just the wedding, like it's not gonna be the suit that is gonna be on my closet forever so I can use like it my dress. like your dress exactly so I can use it in Barcelona or on other weddings and so I think it's gonna take like two months so I can get it I don't know if I'm gonna have to go back again to take like more measurements I hope that I don't mm -hmm. 